welcome to smile tech apps mobile help channel in this video i will be showing how to install drivers to the lumia 950 uh, where we have installed the windows 10 arm so just to repeat a few steps uh, so first thing what we did is we applied the os image that is the windows 10 arm os image to on the Lumia 950 through the use of DSM tool then next what we did is we use the DSM tool to install the necessary stable drivers please note that stable drivers are different for Lumia 950 and Lumia 950 itself okay so let me just go quickly yeah. so let me just open uh, the folder to show the stable drivers and let me just minimize this keyboard here for one second okay so I'm just going there so let me just read out sorry so it's uh, driver then uh, files version 1 drivers stable if you see there is a folder called stable so I'm going there so as you can see there is a uh, ACP bridge ADC BAM battery manager CDA GPIO I2C PEP PMIC RPN SMD SMMIU SPI SPMI Spimbatic uh, Touch Touch Power so uh, please note battery manager driver should not be installed uh, at the first step that is uh, when you apply the image so please exclude battery manager and the pep driver okay. these two drivers you can install it later so excluding this you can install the remaining drivers to the phone so the battery manager driver needs to be installed only after the first windows 10 setup is complete in the sense first boot is complete you will go to the windows start screen then uh, shut it down and then you can enter the master storage mode and uh, install the battery manager driver and also import the registry file i have uh, i have shown this particular uh, uh, step in the videos so please uh, check my other videos it is there okay so one important thing which you need to understand is the pep driver which is in this particular folder it's it is telling as stable whereas this is only applicable to nine lumia 950 itself and not lumia 950 please do not install pep driver to lumia 950 non itself phones okay so so we have already installed these so I am using okay. I am showing the walkthrough on Lumia 950, so I will not be installing the pep driver. Apart from that, I have installed remaining drivers. So apart from that, you need to go to this testing folder. These are the other other drivers which we need to install it manually. In the sense, uh, not all drivers are safe to install. So I will let you know which are the drivers that are safe to be installed. Please do not install all the drivers because it may create blue screen error and you will not be able to log in or load or to windows 10 so it might create a serious error okay so starting with the first uh, folder by bakery we know we are not installing i will uh, read out the folders where we will be installing so the first folder is hn hwn led so let me just okay in parallel i've also opened the um, control panel uh, device manager uh, screen so here it should, as you can see here this this is the other device folder where we would need to install all the remaining drivers so so a lot of these are the lot of other uh, drivers which got installed at the first uh, boot and this few battery drivers okay so so let me just go and install okay we need the on screen keyboard because it has the right uh, red key there so let me let me just open the folder now back 
yes testing yes i'm here okay so yes we are here so okay so i am just going to the hw led the first folder so this we will be installing it so you click on the right click here on the keypad and just say install so this i have already installed so i will not be installing it again please install it in yes this is the first one okay so next we are going to h uh, okay so next we are going to h and w h a p t i c h aptics so this you will you can install it so if you see if you pull up, press the right click in the on screen keyboard you get an open install print option so just install it this say open and uh, these are like you'll get this message and just say yes and uh, you may get a warning message this is just a signature uh, we have already a signature warning so you can go ahead and install this particular driver so if you see once the installation is complete the control panel screen refreshes the unknown device list and this is done okay now we are going back so next this q link local so let me just go to q link local so i'm just going there so the third one is q link local q link local yes you click on the inf file right click then install open then it says yes then yes this way so it's getting installed and you can see a refresh of the control panel screen again so it's like the drive uh, the the uh, device has been successfully installed so it's like if you see it's just refreshing many times here so wait for the com uh, completed ok method and uh, then we will be good then we will be ready to install the other uh, devices so most of the unknown devices uh, gets installed here so basically you would need to wait a little for the setup process to complete so as you can see there are a lot of devices okay now we got a message saying it has been successfully completed just click ok yes so that device is successfully installed okay now let's go to the next one now again i'm gonna zoom it back okay so next is n i p i b i f so the driver so where is it oh here in the top so I click this i click the right click and i click install i click open and i click yes and i click uh, install this driver then i just minimize this to see show you the uh, refreshing of the control panel here so it is basically like trying to install the drivers here so so i think it's done we got your operation is completed then we are gonna go back to the word document where is the my word document yes here it is so i'm just going back to the system folder so let's just Q C R E V R M N E T. So that is here. Yeah, and I install this. Same process. Install. Open. And then say yes. So if you see again, uh, you can see the. Control panel scale where it refreshes. So, so basically, these drivers have a specific purpose. Each you would need to install these specific drivers. Okay, next this uh, QCFM uh, QC 
ओके नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट ड्राइवर इस क्यू सी एफ एम एस एल ट्रांसपोर्ट सो दिस ऑल्सो नीड्स टू बी इंस्टॉल्ड सो वन सेकेंड इन जस्ट क्लिक केयर सॉरी क्लिक क्लिक केयर क्लिक ऑन माई राइट क्लिक ओके सॉरी दिस इज दिकी की स्विच है प्रेस्ड ओके ओके सो दिस एन इंस्टॉल एन ओपन एंड इट सेस यस एंड जस्ट सी द मोमेंट एट द बैक इंस्टॉल एंड योर कंट्रोल पैनल इज वेरी रिफ्रेश अगेन ओके इट इज रिफ्रेश्ड ओके ग्रेट वी हैव इंस्टॉल दिस आल्सो सॉरी क्लोज दिस ओके देन आई एम गोना कम बैक testing okay so that is also done next qc icpa uh, qc icpa yes qc icpa rear rear inst sorry open and sorry i just opened in the notepad here sorry Uh, cancel 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 let me do document no okay cancel again now this select here this right click this say install this say open this say yes and uh, if we see just refreshes now okay this is also complete very good okay so now the next driver is qdss qdss uh, so you need to be very careful in installing the uh, test the drivers in the testing folder uh, only few are uh, few gets installed without any errors few creates the blue screen error also as i told you in the initial uh, of this video so next this uh, qc okay next i think we can go to okay we will slip uh, skip that qdss we will go we are going to qch hc filter qch c filter okay let me just check where it is G H O oh, R, sorry, it is down here. Q C H. Sorry, since my keyboard is here. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay, let's install the Q D S S also. It's it is here. So I was not able to find that. Yeah, and just say open. Sorry, yeah, this is it just went there. so i just want my keyboard back here and i just say right click here and uh, install open it says yes and you say the operation is completed successfully so qds is also done so Next, let's install uh, that QCH HC filter. So it is right here. Let me just minimize my mouse. Sorry, keyboard. So yes, this. Okay, it has opened here. I don't want it. Let me. open it in the same screen okay let me get back my keyboard so select again this this right click so install sorry i just cancelled it uh and just opening it sorry so i'm going to right click here i'm going to select install Yes, 
and it gives me this message yes and gives me that other dialog box yes and you see the refresh of the control panel yes so this is also done now coming back so we have completed uh, okay etsy filter we have completed next we are going to qc emuets 8994 QC Emuets 8994 Okay, very sorry QC Emuets Let me minimize this Okay, QC So let's install uh, QC Emuets 8994 at uh, last uh, so let's go directly to uh, QC GNSS. So QC GNSS is here. So let's just complete it faster. Here I want my on screen keyboard. Here the keyboard is here. So I just right click this. Install open. 